Hey everybody, Mark Russo here. And today just a quick hit on golf balls and what's the difference? So many of you know I'm a Titleist guy, so we're just gonna talk strictly the Titleist line. First off, let's answer a question that many of my students will ask me. Why so many different SKUs? Why so many different types of balls? Well, there's a lot of different performance aspects, but people like choices, right? Everybody's got different budgets. Uh, they're looking for something different. So choice is a great thing. So that's what they're there for. But we're gonna talk specifically today about the three premium brands or premium pieces in a Titleist line. So from top, from bottom to top, the AVX, which I have a yellow one here, that's what I played last year. And then we have the uh, Pro V1 and then the Pro V1X, which is the red number, okay? So first off, just what's the difference? Well, pretty simple. First off, let's understand where you need to fit your golf ball from. It's not from here, the T. It's really from over here at the green. Okay, when you're talking about these three, they're really gonna perform distance-wise about the same off the tee, okay? So, first off, understand what you want out of a golf ball. Very simply, the AVX is gonna feel the softest, the Pro V1 is gonna feel in the middle, and the Pro V1X is gonna feel the firmest around the greens. And that's the first thing. You want to understand what feel you want around the greens. For me, I really like the soft feel of the AVX. However, it is also the lowest spinning ball, okay? So for me, it didn't grab quite as quickly when I started playing in tournament conditions where it was a little firmer. So I may switch to something that's gonna spin maybe just a little bit more. So first off, understand what you want around the greens. Do you like soft feel, firm feel? What conditions do you play on a normal basis, okay? Those are things to take into consideration. If you play soft conditions generally, you can get away with a little lower spinning ball most likely because it's gonna land and stop quicker because the ground is softer. Firmer conditions, firm greens, you better be looking for maximum spin, okay? Now off the tee, what are they gonna do? Well, the spin characteristics and the dimples take over there and the AVX is gonna launch the lowest, okay? The Pro V1 is gonna be right in the middle and then the Pro V1X is gonna be the highest peak height uh, that you're gonna see out of the three of them, okay? Now again, Distance-wise, it's not gonna be a huge, huge difference, but you will see different trajectories. So it's really up to you what you're looking for. But again, when you're fitting your golf balls, if the budget allows for the premium level ball, you're gonna get the best performance out of these, no question, okay? Especially when we're talking over here. So make sure, as much as distance is a big thing these days, dial it in with what you want around here. If it really matters to you, buy a sleeve of each, Go test them out from the same conditions and see what you get and see what you like. You can always figure it out from here, but the difference here isn't big enough for you to make the choice of what ball you're playing from the tee. Fit it around the green, work back, and I promise you, it'll be worth your time doing the research. Hope that helps. See you on the lesson tee.